Well, we just got to the stream here. We wanted to fish for brookies this morning. It's a little chillier than we wanted. Uh, we had a dry dropper rig on from this past weekend, but decided to change over and put on two nymphs because we really don't feel like they're going to be eaten off the top. So I'd rather have a better chance of having two nymphs and finding out what they're taking and then go from there. And if it warms up this afternoon, Maybe put on the dry dropper again and try to get some dry fly takes, or if not, we'll have the nymph on the bottom still. See any of that. <laughs> First brook trout of the day. Well, second, because I caught one off the camera by accident. I do that quite often. I don't try to. But, and, oh, it came right out. Thanks, little guy. But, we opened, we got to the stream, and I opened up my car and realized we got my net, so. Trying to be extra careful with the fish, just keeping them in the water, getting a quick shot of them, and then just letting them go. These brook trout are super delicate and we don't want to hurt them at all. Keep your hands wet, keep them in the water, and just let them go, and they'll be, they'll be good to go for the next person to catch. Fizzled out a little bit. What a big giant valley, God dang. I don't know, just fishing kind of just turned off, so I mean, we're in central Pennsylvania, we can go find a new stream to fish. 
see if we can't go find some more before the day ends. What do you think? Yep. Heck yeah. Alright, we're just doing it. We'll just go, we'll just go for it. I think I know where I'm going. If not, yeah, we'll figure it out. We just got to this new stream here. It's a it's a smaller stream. But uh I'm gonna gonna tie up a we'll tie on an old old uh trusty mop fly I tied up because the stream's a little dirty and I wanna clean it up a little bit, clean up all the brook trout in it, so <laughs> had to say it. But yeah, I like sometimes in these small streams with these brook trout I like putting either a little streamer on or something and then jigging these little pockets. If I can find my box I want. Just jigging these little pockets where they like to hide in these punch bowls and it works it sometimes work a lot it works a lot better than uh, like an infinite or something. So we're gonna give it a try. It would pass. I should take this to my dentist. How can I get this implant? <laughs> then when he, when one day you're on the stream, you're like, "Yeah, hey, oh man, I forgot my flies." You just make, like, "No worries, <laughs> got you a mop fly, bud." We've been getting a, a lot of questions recently on like our length of rod and our setup for like small brookie streams and this is a perfect example of why we like to use and why we like to use our 10 foot rods here yeah the casting's a little hard and challenging but uh see how far see how far back i am from the stream here so when i cast i got all that extra length because the water's clear of course but now i can stay back and i can get a good cast i can get a good cast in that run and then i can fish i can fish that run and yeah like right here i have to bring my rod back but I'm away from the stream the whole time. So like with a smaller rod, it'd be very difficult to get that cast. You'd almost, because there's no back casting room and you can't really roll cast here. So you'd have to get that much closer to the stream and at that point you might scare the fish. So that's why we prefer to use our longer 10 foot rods even on the smallest of streams is just because the extra, the extra reach so we can stay back and not spook the fish. be a tough spot but there has to be a fish in here right so oh I missed them I can't oh. oh I don't it's a nice one too Fish of the day right there. Look at this stream. What? What the hell is the size of this stream? Six feet? Oh man. This this branch, this branch right here is killing me. I watched him come out and eat it. I didn't think he'd eat again. Yeah. 
you see that little bugger? He friggin' go off. Go. Am I going straight for the top by the log? Yeah. We're in 100%. Kiki bugger here. There's a whole school of them under there. They must have stalked here yesterday. <laughs> oh yeah, there's a good one up here, son. See here, I'm being very stealthy using this for cover before I cast in. the brown that fish that brook shot looked like a football Be oh. you don't want to like try to horse like squeeze them or something too hard so you try to get them real nice and the barbless hooks they flop around like they do and pops right out I guess that's the price you pay when you get your net uh. Uh. all these fish in here we're not we're on our the second stream didn't do too good. So now we're on this third little stream on our way home, and we've been, I mean, not we. The kid's been filming me hooking fish. I've been missing them. I tried to give him the rod. He wouldn't accept. He said he's having too much fun laughing at me watching me miss all these fish. So. Ah. Roll the day. Bring a net. That one wasn't a net, man. That wasn't a net. I freaking, my rod got tangled up here. Did you see the, did you see the fire belly on that fish? Unreal, man. This fish, this fish after fish. It's not like I didn't get a good hook set because I, I felt the take a hook and just, the barbell, they just, they're just swinging their head so much, they're just rolling and they just pick the hook so fast. I feel the little bump, I'm just like... See him eating it when the fly was dangling in the water. Crazy little place this fish. That fish came out of that little crack over there. Are you filming? Mm -hmm. Oh. Well, we just got back to the car. 
ended up fishing a total of three streams today. The first one started off pretty good. Second one, not so good. Third one was very good, but couldn't hook a fish and get it in to save our lives. No fault of Caleb, that was all my fault. But, it, hey, like my dad always says, a bad day fishing is better than a good day at work. So we're out here, what, probably getting close to 50 degrees now and uh, just enjoying the fishing. So thanks for watching. Damn, that car. Let's You're settle like men. Come on. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Rock. <laughs> Best two out of three. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. <laughs> Get some, son. <laughs>